hello guys welcome back to the channel so today we are going to see how to create the extension method in c -sharp. this is one of the like most uh, frequent task interview question in c -sharp and dotnet so whenever you are appearing for interview there is a high probability that this question may be asked uh, from you okay so let's see so let's create one class first so this is my uh, project already created youtube demo okay so i'm going to create one class where i will be demonstrating uh, how the extension method should be created okay so uh, let's create one class first okay so let's create one class called let's name the class as uh, some class okay okay let's make it public now uh, what we'll be doing here is let's create one main method here so that's done i mean uh, this 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 class is done now see what is extension method basically is so man lo ki us class ke paas do methods hai addition and subtraction ka and you want to achieve the multiplication also with the help of that class is it possible directly no because that class doesn't contain the multiplication method so hum kya karenge let's first uh, create one more project okay so we are going to that uh, we are going so we'll be creating one project okay uh, and we'll be importing that dll of that project here okay okay so let's uh, let's create one uh, project okay where we'll be building the uh, methods as well as the class okay and then we'll be importing the dll of that project here to use it and extend that uh, particular class okay so let's create one new project okay uh, having console app next okay uh, let's make it as uh, uh, what you can make it as let's make it as math project okay so this is my math project is created let's delete this program.cs file now let's create one class file here okay uh, let's name this class file as third party third party math now <clears throat> let's make this class as public class third party math okay or uh, let's create two methods here one for addition and another another for the subtraction okay so i will be making as public int addition i will be passing two parameter int x comma int y okay then i will be returning uh, x plus y okay let's create one more method for subtraction so we'll be seeing how we can extend this class okay because on this class will not have a multiplication method and we'll try to uh, we'll try to achieve that multiplication there so subtraction will be x minus y okay now uh, since this project should have one at least one main method so let's create one main method however we don't need this main method okay but just to avoid any error we are making it so just print one statement and say that third party math project okay that's done so this is done now what we'll be doing is uh, let's build this project first okay so that we can we can import the dll of this project into our main project okay now this is our main project right and this is the class where we are going to use it so what we can do here is <coughs> we can go to a uh, youtube demo and then we can add the reference okay so project reference and we can add the math project here okay now uh, what we'll be doing here is uh, we will be calling that uh, particular class okay so what is the class we have so this is third party math right so we can call this third party math and we can create some object okay it needs reference so i just need to provide the namespace here okay so what we can do here is uh, the the two things are easy right addition and subtraction is fine because uh, uh, this obj does have those two methods okay so if i can do addition and then 4 comma 5 uh, it supports because that particular this third party math class has this addition method if i can do int difference okay then also this is fine it will give me the result dot subtraction okay let's do 10 comma 3 okay so these two are fine here comes the concept of uh, extension method okay now if i want to so if i want to achieve the multiplication okay with the same set of class is it possible will be will i be able to write it so int multiplication 
is equal to obj dot multiplication there is no such methods right so it's not even possible so how to achieve it so this is possible with the help of extension method okay so i will show you how to write the extension method okay so let's create one static class here so we can write public static okay uh, static class and then we can we can give the name as extension class okay extension inside this class we are going to create our extension method which supports multiplication okay so uh, the syntax will be public static so these two are the key so your class should be a static and the method should be a static for extension method your return type should be integer because you want to achieve the multiplication then you can write the method so what is, what is the method you want to inject into the uh, third party mat okay so it should be multiplication okay and then you need to inject this uh, third party math with the help of this keyword okay so this then this third party math and then you can create one object okay so obj third party okay comma so here we want to pass the parameter as uh, something like num1 comma and num2 okay and just write your logic so what you want to return uh, num1 into num2 right so that's done okay now if you try to uh, see the multiplication it will come okay so obj dot it will give you the multiplication also so see it is giving you right multiplication you're gonna write 3 comma 4 so what we have done simply is we have extended the methods of this third party math class okay so you can you can further do it for uh, something else also right uh, if you want to achieve uh, one more thing like uh, what we can write if you want to achieve area of rectangle okay in this case what you have to provide here is uh, length okay and then breadth okay. and then you can return here into so and if you write here like int area is equal to obj so obj is nothing but the object of this third party math okay this different project but we are adding the method we are extending the methods of this class so now it will uh, supports uh, it will support this method also area of triangle c and you just need to pass the parameter like 4 comma 5 okay or you can pass anything Let's run this and see uh, if it is throwing the exact uh, output. Okay. Okay. What is the error? Okay. Difference. Okay. Fine. So some other class of this project has the main method. So probably this class. Okay. So we need to comment it out first because one project can have uh, only one main method. Okay. Now let's run this. See. Uh, so sum it will give you nine. Okay let's see what is the difference the difference is 7 10 minus 3 7 multiplication is 12 okay 3 into 4 is 12 and area of rectangle is l into b 4 into 5 is 20 okay so this is how guys we can achieve the extension method in uh, c sharp okay uh, thank you all for watching the video if you still have some doubt just uh, uh, write it down in the comment box i will try to resolve your query okay so have a nice day bye bye take care uh, and uh, if if you like the channel then do subscribe it too